Uh, so to just touch lightly on those, VECO Office Client, that is the, again, the core platform. Uh, that's what allows you to publish data from the modeling systems or import data uh, from the modeling systems, uh, activate the models, visualize all the data. You can generate uh, reports. We essentially have a similar to crystal report type engine where you can design your own reports uh, from any of the data that is stored inside of VECO Office. Uh, we also have read-only views of a lot of the other modules. Uh, inside of the VECO Office client. Uh, constructability Manager, again, that's what lets you do the class detection, uh, track uh, the issues until they're resolved. Uh, takeoff Manager calculates quantities. We don't just use the quantities that come from the modeling systems. Uh, we actually have algorithms that analyze the geometry and determine uh, the, the quantities that uh, the construction industry needs. So uh, again, we use the column as an example. You don't want six sides of a cube for the surface area. You want the vertical surface area and because that's what you need to drive an estimate. All right. Cost planner is what, uh, what takes those quantities, converts it into labor equipment materials, allows you to price that, put markups on it, uh, distribute your add-ons. It's essentially a full-blown estimating system. Uh, cost explorer is the visual way of analyzing that. It supports target cost design. Uh, so you can establish cost targets up front, uh, and then you have a stoplight color system to compare how you're doing uh, against those uh, over time. Uh, LBS Manager creates or splits the model into locations, cuts the walls and slabs for you. You don't need the modeler to do that, uh, and then extracts the quantities uh, from each one of those. Uh, schedule Planner uh, converts that into a, a complete scheduling system. Uh, again, that's that's got pretty much everything you would imagine a scheduling system would have, from cash flow planning uh, to risk analysis, uh, uh, labor and material histograms, everything uh, that you would expect to see inside of that system. Uh, plus, we use the flow line concept, uh, which really helps you easily optimize uh, for continuous labor flow, much more easily than a traditional CPM-based system would allow you to do. CPM calculations are in there. Uh, flow line is just an additional layer of automation on top of that. All right, production controller, that's what helps you track your progress against the plan uh, and then forecast early enough that you can take correct, uh, corrective action uh, to prevent problems. So here you see uh, some alarms where your real productivity is going slower than expected. 